So we're back at it this morning, headed across state lines into North Carolina. So it's late summer, uh, temperatures are starting to change a little bit, we're starting to have some cooler mornings, and um, water temperatures should be getting better here soon, but still a little bit on the warm side of you fishing some of the lower elevations. So we're gonna take this opportunity, do some exploring, head up into the, the higher elevations and fish some headwater streams. So we're gonna go back to a stream I fished uh, about this time last year, but wasn't able to maybe explore as much as I wanted to. So we're gonna take this opportunity and go up and hit it up again. And the goal is to try to focus today on getting above some natural barriers and see see if we can get on some brook trout. So uh, we'll see if we can make that happen, but um, hopefully a big way to explore some, some new water while we're waiting on, waiting on fall to get here. So uh, we'll see what we can get into. Hopefully we can have some luck today. first little look at the river here uh, this is one of the tributaries this is not the one we're probably gonna be fishing we're gonna try to go a good ways past it and head on up and try to make our way above some falls so uh, we'll cross on over and head on up and see if we can get into some brookies see a little bit of it down through the rhododendrons but I'm gonna try to stay kind of hidden back here and uh, we'll probably I'm just gonna try to start fishing with just a dry just a dry fly to see if I can get some of these fish to hit since they tend to be more aggressive but uh, we'll, we'll you know start with one thing and just be ready to ready to change along the way um, just depending on what they're doing so we'll see if we can see if we can get lucky First fly might have been a little bit big for them. Um, I had one try to take it, but just came right off. I had a few flash at it and reject it. So I'm gonna use this little parachute atoms or this little fluorescent stuff on top just so I can see it in this dark little pool. See if we can see if we can get somebody to buy it again. There we go. Nice. Get my hands wet. <laughs> hey, it's a tiny little brookie, but man, we'll take it. Look how colored up that guy is. Get you off and get you back in the water, man. Look at that little guy. There we go. Pretty little trout, nonetheless. First little brookie of the day. That's a good one. <laughs> that is a nice. Ah, oh, it came off. That was a good fish. Ah, that was a good old brook trout. That gorgeous. I'm just gonna sneak down there. Don't spook it.
Whoa. Oh, please stay on. Please stay on. Wow. That is a hoss. That is a hoss. That is a hoss. Come up here. Please don't get off. Please don't get off. Come on, bud. Come on, bud. That is not my head. Oh. Woo! What a beautiful, beautiful brook trout. That may be the biggest, biggest, absolute biggest brook you'll ever caught. That is crazy. That, that is huge. A beautiful, beautiful fish. Nailed that. You can absolutely nail that. <laughs> Not a big fish, but man, that was an awesome take. Get my hands wet. A little bit smaller than that last one. Get the little parachute items as well. Let's get you off, buddy. There we go. Now, yeah, let's get you in time there. Here we go. Bye bye. <laughs> that was awesome. There's two out of there. Let's see if there's any more. <laughs> Another one thought about it. And that there is why you come up high in the mountains. I don't even see that. The temperature in this stream is 58 degrees, whereas everybody below here is probably in the solid upper 60s. That's why we're coming up here. And here we go. Last little bricky. A little one, but we'll take him. Got a good one to end on. Gotta head back out. There he goes. Just getting back down to the trail where I can not be like bushwhacking and can talk a little bit. But man, what a day. I absolutely love chasing brookies and they're the most beautiful fish and they just take you to some of the most beautiful places. So I'm at a loss for words for today. Uh, I caught my personal best brook trout and it, it may be a lifetime before I ever see a fish like that again. That was an absolutely beautiful fish. And uh, I, I mean, just today was totally worth it. So I'm glad we got to come and thank you guys for tagging along, and especially for a, a late summer day when we're all waiting on fall to get here. Hard to beat just getting out and exploring some new country and some new water. And then to top it off, you get lucky enough to catch a few fish, like can't complain. So I appreciate you guys tagging along and we'll look forward to more adventures coming soon. See you guys.